Can you screen share while you're live streaming on places like Facebook and YouTube, Instagram and TikTok? Today we're going to take a look at which platforms allow you to screen share, which ones have special hacks to get around their lack of screen sharing, and which ones you can't yet. So let's dive in and talk about the best places to be screen sharing, and those are Facebook and YouTube. Now Facebook and YouTube are both horizontal video, so when you're live streaming, especially from your desktop, you are streaming in that horizontal format as opposed to the vertical of Instagram and TikTok. Now because we can go through the desktop, it does have the ability to do some screen sharing and we do recommend that you're using a third-party platform like BeLive. BeLive works specifically with these companies to do all sorts of really cool things. So you can have lots of guests on your show, you can screen share, you can do live sales, they can have comments into your chat while you're on air, all sorts of really amazing things inside of this platform and it allows you to do your screen sharing. So you can do it solid screen share so it's just a bunch of slides or videos that you're putting out there. You can also do it so that you're on screen as well. There's some really cool capabilities in here. So Facebook and YouTube, you can both screen share while you're doing things live. So not only can you put out like a PowerPoint presentation or pre-recorded videos, but you can do things in real time. For example, I edit book covers or I edit photos on air to teach people how to do it while I'm doing it in real time and they can see exactly what I'm doing inside of Photoshop as I work. If you are gaming, if you are editing, if you're doing anything where you're showing real-time things, Facebook and YouTube is the platform for you. Now I've got lots of great tutorials on how to do this down in the description bar below, but in BeLive all you have to do is click the button for screen share and then click it from your lobby, bring it up from your staging area to your main screen and then arrange it on screen the way that you want. It's so easy to do, it's just a couple of little clicks and you are off to the races and it is so incredibly easy and time saving. Facebook and YouTube are the place to be and if you want to simulcast through BeLive, you can do that too. Now, Instagram is interesting because it's a little bit different than Facebook and YouTube. We are filming exclusively from our phones. We cannot do it from a desktop yet because the API is not open. So at this current time of filming this video, we can only live stream from our phones, which means we only have access to what's on our phones. So while we can't technically screen share, we can use our camera roll. Now, not all phones have this capability. Some Androids and some older model phones do not have this capability, so hit the subscribe and notification bell. I'm gonna tell you exactly how to get around this, how to work with this, what you need to know in the next video. If your phone is one that doesn't automatically do this for you, we're gonna do some troubleshooting it, so subscribe and notification bell for the next video. But with Instagram, all you have to do is pre-select what you wanna show. You can show slides, you can show video, you can do whatever you want, as long as it's inside of your camera roll. So this means you cannot screen share live and you cannot game live and you cannot edit live and show people on Instagram. That's just not something we have the capability of doing at this point in time through Instagram. So you wanna make sure that you are pre-recording anything that you have to explain to then show them on screen. All you have to do is go down to the bottom of your phone, click on the little camera roll button, it will pop up your camera roll, and pro tip here, if you don't see the image that you want, sometimes if you put it on a computer and send it to your phone, it doesn't register as part of your camera roll, so you may need to take a screenshot of it or save it in a different way so that it looks like it was native content to your phone, then you'll be able to pull that up. Now I've got more on that down below. I've got a full breakdown on how you can be screen sharing both video and photos on your Instagram live streams in the description bar below. So hit that up. That's a really important thing for you guys to be learning if you're going to be live streaming on Instagram. And again, we're going to be talking in the next video about what to do if you don't have this feature or if you can't find this feature, how to troubleshoot it and next steps to take. So check out that next video and make sure that you are using this actively inside of your Instagram live streams. Bonus points here. You can actually flip or invert where your photo is. So you will always see yourself on screen. There's always going to be a little box of you speaking to your audience and then the background is usually the photo order you're showing but you have the ability to switch that so you're bigger and that is smaller. Check out the videos down below. I got tons of tips and tricks on this one for you. Now TikTok currently does not allow you to live stream with screen sharing. You cannot pull things up on screen like you can on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram. Now the cool thing is Facebook and YouTube allows you to actually pull up user comments. You can pull up really cool interactive engaging things on screen so that you have the ability to interact with people who are writing into you in real time. Instagram also allows you to pull things up on screen if people are sending in questions to the question box either during your live stream or from your Instagram stories. More on that in the description bar down below. But TikTok is just straight 
film footage. Whatever you've got on screen is what you've got. And I need you to remember when you're live streaming on TikTok, it is inverted. They are seeing the opposite of what they should be seeing. So if you're holding up words, if you're holding up a piece of paper with notes on it or information on it to kind of screen share, you have to remember to mirror image your footage or people won't be able to read it. I hold up my books all the time because you know I'm a best-selling author and I have to remember to actively go in and click on that button. So that's just down at the bottom. You're going to click on the little icon there. It's going to pull that up for you and then you're just going to hit that mirror button and then people will be able to read the words the correct way that they should be on your TikTok screen. So when it comes to live streaming, you can screen share on Facebook, on YouTube, and even on Instagram, but currently you cannot on TikTok. And if you want more on this, I've got tons of videos and tutorials down in the description bar below. I highly recommend screen sharing because this is a great way to communicate information to your people as you are live streaming. But if you've got questions on this, get down in my comments. Let me know what do you need to know about Facebook, about Instagram, about YouTube, about TikTok, about screen sharing, or about live streaming. I will happily get your questions answered. And if you are interested in BeLive, I got a special bonus for you. They just gave me a 20% off discount code. So not only can I get you an extended trial of this for free, I can get you 20% off when you decide to jump in because it's going to be the best purchase you can make for your business right now if you're marketing on social media. So check that out down below. Lots and lots of information in the next video. We're going to be breaking down what to do if you cannot get the camera roll up inside of your Instagram live streams. And we're going to continue on our conversation on how you can grow a profitable business through smart social media marketing. I'm KM Robinson, social media marketing educator and speaker, and I'll see you in the next video where we're talking all about Instagram live.